I'm David Wiesel. I am a member of the Myeloma Division at the John Thurder Cancer Center at Hackensack Hospital. I'm also a professor of medicine at Georgetown University where we have an affiliate myeloma program. Today we are talking about multiple myeloma and the use of high dose therapy with hematopoietic stem cell transplant for the treatment of the disease. It's the indications who, wet, when, and how, how well it works, should you have one or two, should you have consolidation, more therapy after, should you have maintenance therapy after, and then we talk very briefly about the concept of donor transplantation. So the question arises is when to do the transplant, who to do the transplant in, and what, what have we learned in the last five years or more? The answers to the questions are that transplant has been compared to no transplant in four recent trials. All four trials, two of them published, two of them presented in preliminary forms at our international meetings, all showing that transplant early is better than waiting and doing a transplant later. So all patients should be considered for transplant in the upfront setting. The other messages that are important are that the deeper responses end up with better outcomes. The more disease you get rid of, the better your remission duration and probably how, how long you're going to live is all included in the depth of the response. We are fortunate here at John Thoreau Cancer Center to have the whole spectrum of disease and course of the disease managed and treated by an excellent team of physicians, nurse practitioners, nurses, and ancillary staff that I think is second to none anywhere in the country or the world.